Lab Coat 21 is officially banned. Well, not officially, but community banned, she just might be. This is coming off the tail coats of an IGN article posted by Lewis Parker, this guy who has enjoyed fighters since it's come out back in 2018. He can be kind of credible, and he's actually credited a lot of pro players as well. And this kind of sparked the community to say, should we just ban 21 from basically tournaments altogether, local tournaments, just co community ban her. Just nobody play her so we can all just enjoy the game that we enjoy. Because as it stands right now, this is easily the most powerful character in the game and she does not make the game very fun. Android 21 is a character that can literally take your damage from you, put it onto her own specials and it really doesn't become fun. A game that already struggles with time constraints like Dragon Ball Fighters does, um, the fact that games last way longer than they should, and then you put a character in the game that can nerf characters damage against somebody like a Yamcha or even Trunks where they can't do enough damage to sustain anything is kind of ridiculous in the first place. So the character is in talks of being just community banned. It's all over Twitter. And I truly believe this is a discussion that does need to happen. Now, uh, it's kind of sad because there was a guy who, when the character first came out, decided, you know what, maybe we should ban this character. Um, he probably was prophetic and saw the the true ways of the character before she was truly played. I see, saw a lot of people in the community kind of dogpiling on this guy, basically just stating, no, we can't ban this character yet because we don't even know what she's like um, in the online. We don't know what she's like in tournaments. And of course, a couple of you know weeks and months go by, and of course, she is easily the menace of the game, the new menace of the game. Now, I don't know if truly the the whole community as a whole, like even the online community, I know a lot of the pro players and you know. Uh, content creators they can be the large minority where their voice feels like it's being heard so much more than you know the casual player i don't know if casual players are struggling against a character like this truly or if they're just mashing their face into the controller and saying you know what this character is fine i don't care i truly don't know but in all actuality this does hurt you know pro players you know when you're forced to basically pick up a character because it's your only option when when this game can literally be your way of living your income i totally understand and for most people they kind of just want to get back to what dragon ball fighters was before this character the meta wasn't a good place you know everybody could pick their team there was no true 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 strongest i feel like the new z z change mechanic um that was added into the game in place of season three was amazing and it brought so much life into the game that allowed for so many different new combinations and it was great until android 21 came out so i think the discussion does need to be had and i think if people are going to truly community ban this character so be it right let me know what you guys think down in the comment section below but that's all i pretty much got for you if you enjoyed this video please like comment and subscribe please remember that god and anime are always on your side that's all i got for you peace out